The hunt is really the theme of the, the team right now. Uh, we're we're basically we're chasing the other teams in the Big Ten. We we can't make any secret about that. And uh, to chase them, we got to go hunt every single day. And, and that's the theme of the off season. That's the theme of the team right now. Whether it's in the weight room, out in the indoor uh, with our special workouts, or in practice. And uh, hunt work is uh, uh, extra work for the players too. Um, you know uh, we're limited with the number of hours that we can be around our players. If they want to truly reach their goals and close the gap between us and other teams in the Big Ten, they have to hunt and get extra hunt work in on their own. And, uh, that's what that's for. And that's just that, that banner out in the indoor is just a symbol to, to remind them every single day of what we're trying to accomplish here. Uh, the black stripe uh, on the helmet, that's uh, actually something I brought to, from Ohio State. Uh, it's been a tradition in Ohio State for a long time. Um, uh, the black stripe is a symbol that uh, when it's removed from your helmet, uh, you are uh, game ready. You're, you're combat ready to go play. And uh, the players know that if they have a black stripe on their helmet, uh, they will not play in a game here. They're not ready. Uh, they're not ready in terms of their ability, in terms of their trust level, um, and um, a lot of other things that could go into it. So through the course of practices, uh, we're looking for players to demonstrate the characteristics that we want in our players. And at some point, uh, that stripe can be, or, or their coach can nominate them to get the black stripe removed from their helmet. That could be this spring. It could be next training camp. It may be a year from now. Uh, it just depends on the individual and how he uh, progresses through practice. But that uh, is kind of the rite of passage in our program that uh, we call it, you've been knighted uh, if you take that black stripe off and um, you become a warrior and you're ready for uh, combat. We're, we're not going to talk about winning. We're not going to talk about championships. I'm uh, not going to talk about red letter games and things like that. We're going to talk about the process of getting 10 strong. Uh, we we uh, have 10 really position groups on the football team. Uh, when you uh, count the offense, defense, and the, the specialists uh, uh, together, and if we can get 10 units operating at maximum capacity, then we're going to have a chance for success. And that's really what it's all about for us.